Hi, the Magic Dragonfly here with a Boom Beach video, and today we're going to look at the NPC base Shotless. The troops we're going to be using today are heavies and zookas, backed up by one landing craft with medics on board. All of the landing craft containing our heavies are level 16, so they all have one less heavy on than they would have if they were maxed at level 20. Our landing craft with our zookas are level 18, level 20 and level 20, so one of those is also one zooka light of the maximum number. Our troop levels are our heavies and our zookas are both maxed at level 20 and our medics are level 9. We have no statues boosted today, so this is a normal attack. Let's take a look at the base then. Shockless, level 59, so an almost maximum level NPC base. Let's scout it to see what's there. The headquarters is right in the middle, set towards the back, and it's protected by three boom cannons. They're our major problem, because they will one-shot everything we have. On the right-hand side, on the face of it, that looks pretty easy. A couple of mortars, a few machine guns. However, all of those boom mines are level 16, and will almost certainly kill something if we try and go in that direction. If we go left, which is the way we are going to go, we have three cannons, a couple of mortars, uh, and again, we need to be very careful that they don't do a lot of damage to our troops. So let's launch the attack and see how we approach it. The first thing we need to do is remove the threat of those boom cannons in the centre, and we're going to do that by launching some barrage at them first. That takes a couple of them out, and then we'll just drop some artillery on the one on the left to finish that one off. We're then going to land our troops from the left-hand side of the beach and we're going to flare them left and we're going to send them in under the protection of some smoke to stop anything firing at them and then just as that smoke runs out we're going to shock the cannons and the mortars and we're going to start heading in from the left hand side. So two of the cannons have gone down before that shock's run out, the third one is down and then we're heading in, we're working our way in. There's not a lot that's going to do us much damage at this point. We're just going to head back left again to stay out of trouble. And then we'll come in, taking out the machine gun, and then we'll drop a shock on those sniper towers to keep those quiet. We have 38 gunboat energy left, so we have plenty of gunboat energy left. And as we head in, we're just going to drop a shock on those sniper towers, those mortars on the right-hand side to keep those quiet. We'll drop another shock on them there. And the headquarters is down. And we have lost no troops. No troops at all. So if you're using heavies and zookas, I think that's pretty much the best way to approach shockless. If you found the video interesting, please give me a like. And thanks for watching.